finish up my review and do my first impression on both of these I guess it's a first impression comparison let's just call it that it is the OPI matte top coat versus the wet and wild wild shine matte top coat this retails for 99 cents I got it at the dollar store because I was like what I have to give this a try OPI on Ulta.com I actually just looked it up it is $9.50 so there's a big price range as far as that goes so I know I changed the color of my nails but it's because I'm leaving to go to Seattle so I need to redo my nails so the verdict OPI or wet and wild shine I don't know if it's just me but wet and wild matte top coat actually did and performed way better than the OPI I use it on my right hand and so of course I got more use out of it thinking that maybe it would be some sort of bias because I do use my right hand more. But this OPI, like even if it was just on the left hand, it, as a top coat, it sucks. I'll give you that much. It, it, you can tell in the video, I mean, in the clip before this whole review that it started to like chip away at the ends and that was only for a week. They both dried around the same time. They both had the same finish, obviously, but when it came right down to it as far as the long wear it would probably go to the wet and wild I can probably do a backwards comparison and put the wet and wild on my left hand and do the OP on my right just to see maybe I don't know but all together my comparison wet and wild wins out so and it's very affordable 99 cents as compared to the 950 for the OPI don't get me wrong I'm gonna use the OPI still because I mean 950 Jesus Christ I can't believe May paid that much for this it was on my Christmas wish list which is why she bought it for me but yes verdict is this I hope you guys like this video and if you did go ahead and give it a thumbs up and if you want to see more videos by me go ahead and click on the bottom red button right down there it would totally make my day and I will see you guys for my next video bye